this is 4x. I'm doing my daily t uh, tutorials on Winterstone Tournament Cabin Fever uh, Gold Difficulty with my knight. So let's hit it. I should have put this here because I believe these guys will get stunned by a. Nope, they are resistance to stun. So, next chance I get, I'm going to get out of there and put that back. To. What the hell? Okay. Uh, the key is to not to take on one at a time and to get out of the way of every one of their major attacks. Um. They telegraph them pretty well, so all you need to do is move most of the time. Yeah. And uh, and again, you keep moving. Unfortunately, with uh, the knight, their reliance on having to be melee means they have to um, get in close to everybody. Um, Ideally, you want to focus on one at a time and get in there real quick when you got one of your protection uh, skills on and then get out. Alright, time to move. And as you can see, um, I'm lagging real bad as I'm falling when I'm way far away from everybody. Um, try to get in here and get another round at him. Okay. Now, of course, when you got your angelic form, take the, the complete, uh, take advantage of it and get in there as hard as you can. Time to go. Um, if you're having a really rough time, just run around and use your your hurl to be a long range attacker for the most part. Now these arrowmen have got a special attack too, so you don't want to leave them around for too long. So you can hear. Oh, get out of there! Ah, oh, that's absolutely. Way. Okay, down to one. Gonna make it a little easier to avoid his attacks. You might be able to see, but you still got enemies here that are gonna knock, try to knock you down. But you cannot stick around when the the uh, the whirlwinds are floating around. You gotta get moving. Unfortunately, this this level is not really designed well for a knight because they do have to keep moving to stay uh, the enemies are um, too are uh, too tough to um, just stand there and take it take him for the most part so you have to rely on your protection skills especially angelic form and protector to survive this level well uh, let's go ahead and uh, see what I get and I will show you what how I am currently equipped all right okay nice got the artifact iceberg shard and of course you're probably gonna get some some more valor that's fine so I am currently equipped at with Five, uh, seven of the eight pieces of the fiery harbinger sent, including three elites: the helmet, the glove, and the sh sword. I also have the shoulder guards of the beast master, uh, crown of ice, which does no good for the tournaments, and the medal of the dark wings. Uh, appearance items: I have five of the eight pieces of the radio fist battleware relics, including an elite glove, plus uh, the reaper reaper chest from appearance items and azure steel blade and infernal shell shield trinkets i have the entire blood ruby trinket set including an elite band and uh two of the three soul ritual charms um and of course jewels socketed into all of them at various states of 
evolution. If you like what you see, please subscribe me on Twitch.tv, Twitter, and YouTube. I'm also available on uh, Facebook, and all that's at F-O-U-R-X-1-1-G-D. Again, that's F-O-U-R-X-1-1-G-D. Thank you.